tends to stay in motion, but the work for the word Especially. is your job. You work in the word of yeah, God, yeah. and I so appreciate that, and not ever giving up and not being tired. It's a mental work, but thank you for that word today. It was your work. Listen, I, I had the privilege to be married to this beautiful woman <laughs> who was a certified Zumba instructor, uh, a nutritionist. Her degree is in business, but the productivity has helped keep me healthy. Because I'm an omnivore, I eat whatever I'm, I'm going to eat, but it's helped me. Now, that's a segue from my point. The lesson today, the message today was work. And work is exertion and effort to come to an end result or a product, to be productive. Ten servants had ten pounds in, 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 in the scriptures of Luke, but he only gave the illustration of three. Proverbs 19 and 9 says, a slowful worker is brother to him that is a great waster. You've got to be productive where you are. Stop complaining about the hand you've been dealt yes. and work what you got. Because Jesus said, even he that have not, even that which he has should be taken away. If he doesn't have anything, why would he say he that have not, even that which he has should be taken away? Because whatever you have is so little that you discount it as nothing. He said, well, let me take your nothing away since it's nothing to you. Use what you got. What you work got. what you got. That's the whole message today. Work. I know we're in a bicultural mystic society. It's not, it's not black and white now. It's really becoming Democrat and Republic. It's, it's, it's rich and poor. It's classism. Uh, the bombardment on the Capitol Hill, that was classism at work. And the truth be told, the only equality you're going to have is going to be found in God. You're seeing marginalization even in Christianity. Yes. With, with evangelicals. Uh, you're seeing it. You're seeing it. There's no, no getting about. And, and we have to be strong enough to admit this is an issue. Because if you don't recognize you're sick, you can't get healed. Amen. So join us on Wednesday night at 6.30. Uh, thank God for the commercial that you all did. My yes, birthday is February 8th. They're going to do it. They're going to celebrate it February 7th. And I'm yes. excited about that. Yes. Uh, getting ready to slip out of the 59, 50s. This is my last yeah. year. But we love you. We praise God for you. It's always from our house to your house. It's, it's a, a matter, matter of dominion. dominion.